We begin tonight with a developing story. Charges filed against a father accused of leaving six children in a locked minivan in the midday heat. Neighbors tell CBS2 the children were there for at least an hour, and that's when they jumped in to help. CBS2's Chris Ty has their story. That father telling sheriff's police that he was in that apartment complex in unincorporated Maine Township to clean one of the apartments, and that is why he left those six kids in that hot minivan, ranging in age from one to seven. He's now charged with six counts of misdemeanor child endangerment. Those kids now here at Park Ridge's Lutheran General Hospital are in the care of the state. They were really hot. Yeah. They were crying. They wanted to get out of the car, which, of course, I couldn't take them out of the car. He had no way to get them out. As the temperature was pushing 80, those six kids were pushed to a limit inside this Dodge minivan that led to those screams. Apartment manager Melissa Compton called 911. Two babies you know, in car seats, they had no water, no food that I could see, and the car was locked. With the doors locked, the temperature rising and police on the way, neighbors jumped in. We saw a van, the kids were screaming. Nuar Sa'i lives just feet from where that vehicle was parked. My wife gave some, uh, I guess, like snacks. They funneled snacks and water through a side window, opened only the size of a fist, according to this neighbor who didn't want to be identified. I think it shows people getting together and resolving a problem. There was a problem. Kids needed help. Let's get help. They got them help until police and ambulances arrived minutes later, which took the children here to Lutheran General Hospital. While their conditions were not released, experts say kids can sustain serious injuries after just minutes inside a hot car. Their father was found only after sheriff's police canvassed the Park Colony apartment complex looking for him. He was charged and released on his own recognizance. CBS2 found the van Monday night at the owner's home on Chicago's south side. No one answered the door when CBS2 knocked. The Department of Children and Family Service is now working to place those kids to make sure they are in care. Their father is due in front of a judge next month. His name is not being released to protect the identity of those children. In Park Ridge, Chris Ty, CBS2 News.